we have fast forwarded to Monday. No, is today Monday or Tuesday? Today is Monday. Today is Monday, yes, I'm sure of it. Um, I don't think the footage that I even got during this weekend was any good, but hey, we're gonna roll with this. Today, I am cleaning, because the house is a complete mess. Our cleaning lady used to come every Friday, but um, because of the lockdown, she can't come. So, I am the new cleaning lady. Thank you so much, Corona. I need to get some cleaning done. That's all I'm gonna be doing today. Laundry, cleaning. So yeah, commencing the cleaning time lapse. <laughs> What insanity is this? I haven't been in my car in the longest time, but basically what's happening is that I messaged Food Lovers Market because Keegan told me that we can actually just send them a WhatsApp message and like tell them what we want for groceries and then we can go and collect it. And so I did that earlier and I'm gonna show you myself freaking out and getting excited and doing that earlier today. We just have to add them as a WhatsApp contact and literally send them a message of our grocery list and go and park there and collect our orders. So that's what I'm going to do now because I tried to shop online and I couldn't because pick and pay isn't delivering until the 18th of April. Um, Woolworths if I look on their site, basically nothing is available. Like if I try to add it to my cart, nothing is available. Checkers doesn't deliver in our area. So so it's 11 o'clock in the morning and they say you have to place your order before 3 p.m. So I don't know if your guys' um, food lovers do the same thing, but this is pretty cool. So I'm gonna do that. It says you must just send them your full name and like your grocery list and what time you wanna fetch the stuff. So let's see. Okay, I sent them a message. I haven't sent my list yet. I wanna know when I can collect stuff and we're gonna see if they respond. Oh, by the way, I am done cleaning. I'm now just waiting for the last load of laundry. I need to go and hang that up, but everything else is done. They're typing, they're typing. So they said, yeah, go ahead, but just take note the area that it's exclusively for. I had to go and ask Egan what I should add to the list for him. So now I'm just waiting for them to respond. And I don't know if they will do it because, like, it's not all super essential stuff. Like, there's Nutella. <laughs> like, I need Nutella. We'll see, you guys. There's my list. It's not too long. Update! You guys, they asked me, what time do I want to collect? And I said, 3 p.m. today. <laughs> this is getting me so excited. I don't know why. I've, like, literally never, like send someone a grocery list and been like hey i'm just gonna come and pick this up later park and collect place your orders from 7 a.m to 3 p.m last pickup time is 4 p.m you can place an order for the next day if all goes well i'll be going and collecting my stuff at 3 p.m today and i'll let you guys know how it went so anyway my order is confirmed now and they said i can come and pick my things up at 3 p.m so it is like 2 45 now and that's exactly what i'm gonna go do i am I'm so excited you guys. I haven't been in my car in the longest time. Ah! She still turns on! This is amazing! It's day 11 of the lockdown today. So yeah, it's about 11 days since the last time I left the house and like drove anywhere and stuff. I made it to the food lovers market and I'm not too sure if I'm like supposed to sit here and wait for somebody to come or if I'm supposed to send them a message, or if I'm supposed to go inside and say, hey, I'm here to pick up something. That part was not clear. Another reason I was hoping I wouldn't have to get out of the car. So 
so that was a little less exciting than I expected. Um, I thought the whole point of collections was that everything was already done for you and you get there and you just pay and then it's done. But I literally had to go inside and stand in a queue. I mean, there was like one person in front of me, but still I had to stand in a queue, pay at a till. And their machines, it didn't let me tap. I tried to tap my card to pay so it's contactless. But I started to put my pin in it. The whole point of ordering ahead of time for collection is to not have to like go through all of that. On the plus side, they had hand sanitizers everywhere. So that was an anticlimactic shopping experience. Let me know what other kinds of, oh, that's a funny speed bump. Let me know what other kinds of videos you guys are keen to see during this lockdown because I'm honestly just like vlogging as I go along. I have no idea what kind of content you guys specifically want to see from me. So if you have something specific or some question you specifically want me to answer or something like that, let me know in the comments. And I have plenty of time, so I'm probably going to get to it. Let me show you guys, this is everything that I got. Firstly, I got some bananas, two avos. And then on this side, I got some fresh cream, some coffee. I got a sandwich and a salad for our lunch tomorrow. Got some cool drink got two loaves of bread. I asked for two packs of bacon and they gave me like the world's largest thickest pack of bacon but that's fine. I got some tortilla wraps. I got some Nando sauce because I had run out. Some self-raising flour because Keegan's gonna be baking. Oh. <laughs> That's why it was on the list, it was for you. And then we got two cans of condensed milk, some Jelly Babies, cause candy. Got um, two tennis biscuits and some butter. I swear these people chose the most expensive choice of everything. And some brown sugar. And at the end of the day, we got everything that we needed. I washed my hands, I avoided touching my face. So, I feel pretty good about it, but that's gonna be the end of this vlog. I'm, I don't think I'm doing anything else today except like making dinner, but I don't wanna bore you guys with that. So that's gonna be the end of this vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you on the next one, which will probably be tomorrow, because I wanna make something nice for Keegan's brother and his wife, um, just to thank them for all the yummy food that they've made us lately. So yeah, stay tuned for that. I will see you all in that video. Till then, spread good vibes, be kind, bye-bye.